This video is about the customization of characters on an LCD screen with the Arduino. As you can see, I've got some special characters here, and then all of these, all the characters in the smiley face. And we have blocks, or, or rather pixels, or, or dots here. Uh, there's five across and eight down to make each block here on the LCD screen. So there's five across and eight down. So I've got some code here that I borrowed from Ralph Bacon on his video channel, his YouTube channel. Um, this is about his LCD big digits. Um, so here we have binary code. Now this is a good visualization in binary showing that to make this one character, we're turning binary bits on and off, on, off, on. And this row here, it's all on. So again, we've got five across here, and five, or excuse me, eight down. Similarly, we've got hexadecimal. I like having one row for my, my code. So I like the hexadecimal and the binary, of course, you could have it all in one line if you wanted, but this is a nice visualization. So what I was after was trying to make um, an easy way for me to create custom characters, a visualization. So I have a spreadsheet here. As you can see, I've got these, these blocks. You'll probably recognize these eyes from the LCD earlier, right? Here's an eye, here's a different eye, some mouths the special characters for the Fahrenheit, the degrees Fahrenheit, and then some whatever this is just playing around. So the first, so what you do is you fill these characters up. You just change these zeros and ones. Let me get my mouse over here and let's, let's just change those all to zeros. And you will have noticed that over here, of course, this these rows all changed, and over here, and then down here changed. So, this is just a visualization to show. Oh, okay, here's what it is in binary, hexadecimal, and decimal. So, if you want to put this into your code, depending on which way you prefer, you've got the binary, or you've got hexadecimal, or you've got decimal. So, I'm just going to do a quick test here and just just to prove this. I'm just going to copy this right here and I'm going to go back to my, my code and I'm going to replace the left side of that big smiley face and I'm going to come back here and I'm going to copy this one and I'm going to re replace the right side of the smiley face with the decimal now I have an I missed that character. I accidentally left a character there. So we have this hexadecimal, which is the same character as this character, which is displayed in decimal. So I'm going to upload this sketch to the Arduino and we will see. And there we go. There's our new character, our specialized character. So any, I've got this uploaded to GitHub and I will paste, post the link to that in the description.